Welcome to this explanation video where we will be breaking down how the Pictolite pocket system works. Our pocket system offers extreme accuracy and ease of use. Furthermore, it is very customizable and the example which we are showing here is totally scalable to your specific needs. The system's purpose is to separate items into pockets. Each pocket represents a job to be sent out to a different customer. It can handle jobs with one part or multiple parts, acting as a temporary inventory where the parts are collated together in preparation for further processing. To allow for incoming and outgoing stock to be processed simultaneously, the system works as a two-sided operation with a put side and a retrieve side. To begin, we will explain the process of the put side. On the put side, there will be an operator who has their own handheld barcode scanner. Upon receiving an item, the operator will scan its barcode. This will prompt the system to request the item's job location. The database will instantly find the required pocket for the item and show the exact location with a green light supported by a line of red lights to guide in the operator. The operator will then place the item here and proceed to scan the green highlighted barcode. This tells the database that the item has been added to the job. The operator will continue to repeat this process with the constant incoming items. A job is complete once all of its contents are grouped. Now we will talk about the retrieve side and its method of removing complete jobs from the system. Upon your first look, you will notice a wall of blank, red and green illuminated barcodes. These colours represent the status of its above pocket. A red light means the job is assigned, however incomplete. A green light means the job is complete and ready to move on. And a blank barcode means the pocket is unassigned at this current point in time. An operator will be situated on this side with a handheld barcode scanner. When they see a green barcode light appear, they will be tasked with scanning this pocket screen barcode. Once scanned, it will turn yellow, indicating to the operator that it is selected and ready to be moved. Finally, they will move the complete contents of the pocket into a tote, which is waiting to be dispatched on a parallel conveyor belt. With the job loaded into the tote, the operator will scan the tote's barcode and the tote will automatically dispatch and move down the conveyor to its next processing area. Now let's follow the complete journey of a product being processed through the system. It begins by being scanned by an operator and placed into a job's pocket. Once the job which it has joined is finished, the retrieve side's barcode will light up green. The operator on this side will scan the barcode, take the job's contents and place it into a tote. The barcode of the tote will then be scanned by the operator and the tote will automatically be dispatched to its next location. We know that having human operators can leave an opening for mistakes to be made. This is why we have made an error correction process, which is basic and easy to resolve any issues which you may encounter. The most common errors which are easily resolvable are on the put side. If an operator scans the wrong pocket, the system will light up red and the operator will simply scan the item again and continue with the correct location. If the item which the operator scans isn't registered in the database, the wall of lights will illuminate red and the operator will have to put it aside and scan the next item to continue. If a red barcode is scanned, the whole wall will illuminate yellow to tell the operator it is not feasible. All errors which are encountered are quick and simple to troubleshoot thanks to the touchscreen display making our system perfect for time-sensitive and high-volume applications. Operator and overall system performance metrics can be evaluated either using the touchscreen display or an external console allowing for you to streamline efficiency. Staffing can be adjusted throughout the day if necessary since the Pictolite system acts as a buffer for your moving inventory. There are many ways in which we can configure our system to meet your requirements. Whether it's small, large or an array of joined sections, we can make it happen giving you total control over the size and capacity of your system. Furthermore, the individual pocket sizes can be adjusted to meet the specific needs of your inventory. Thank you for watching this explanation video. And if you would like to see more information on our other bin system, please be sure to watch our other Pictolite videos.